So leading Jeffrey through different doors has been a bit of a struggle for us. So there, yeah, you get his tongue up here. Until I can get his leading a lot better, I've started really challenging him with my backing up stuff. To get him to back through that door, that's a lot of pressure. Okay, that's so bad. Probably Well, clearly we did not set him up for success there. And so we moved those horses, finding just different ways to to make him yield and move off of pressure is great. And so back to him up through this door is one of those ways. Even since the last episode with him, he's really come a long ways in just that short time. One of the next things I wanna get him proficient at is sending him through doors. On that setting myself up for success boat, I don't think we would be very good right there. So it's not so much pressure to get him to move through the eye of the needle. Just like I was sending him out. Nice. I'm just gonna hold this here to there. He just gave me something ever so slight, but I need to praise him for his victories. It's interesting, this foot has never been trimmed, but just look at how nice it is. He's been running out on the prairie and just wearing it down just perfect. Like if I was coming around to trim him, Right now, I would probably tell my client that it wouldn't need trimming. It's in very good condition. to gradually build up to us grabbing that foot, I guess, even though we were doing it yesterday. I just want him to get okay with us tossing ropes everywhere. And then when he feels pressure on that halter to just follow that pressure. And we'll probably spend a minute or two here just letting him think this is the easy place to be. And overall, I think that was a fantastic session. Thanks for following along on another episode. The draw date's getting closer and closer. If you guys wanna see the full training session, go to barjlhorsetraining.com. It will be posted in our membership area. Otherwise, comment below, let us know what you thought. See you next time.